Hey, Rob. How you doing, man? Cyril, how are you? Good to see you. Good to see you. What are you doing in a, in a wetsuit? I was going to ask you, what the hell are you wearing? <laughs> you told me you're fishing from the shore. We are. All those rock points out there and all that white water, we're swimming out to that. Oh, man. That's pretty intense. The water is pretty cold now, isn't it? It's a little bit, but that's what the wetsuit's for. It keeps the sharks away. You'll like that cold water. <laughs> yeah, there's great whites out here, though. They come by sometimes. A good thing we'll be dressed like seals, so we'll be just fine. <laughs> <laughs> You're as crazy as before, man. You haven't changed. <laughs> All right, let's go get changed right, and do, do this. Put this on. I'm going to give you a little privacy. <laughs> the water is freezing. It's barely 50 degrees. Even with a wetsuit, I can tell you, we can still feel its bite. Plus, this is a really strong current. What I really don't like is that the closer we get to the island, the more risky it gets. We could get slammed into the rocks by a big wave. Swimming with a rod in your hand, not easy. Let me tell you, this is pretty extreme. You know, it might seem crazy to swim to some rocks like we did, but the reason why we did that is because from the shore, you're limited. You know, if the fish are busting in the distance, you can't reach them. Whereas here, we were able to actually close the gap between the fish and us. And they're right here, they're busting right in front of us. Here we go. I'm on. It's a striper. Oh, I'm getting hit right now. You hooked up? <laughs> First hit, and it's a double header. The fish are on the hunt here. All right, Rob. <laughs> you man, it's a workout fishing with you. Yeah, you gotta be a little bit crazy to do this. Yeah, but it works. The fish are here. That's it. Proof is in the pudding. Big fish on the rock. We're looking for balsamic core on the surface, but we can't see any. However, we're seeing a bunch of stripers, and right now we're fishing with big lures on top. <laughs> We're having a lot of fun catching stripers. Oh, crazy, man. He's got a tag, huh? Didn't you just tag a tuna? <laughs> I did, man. How oh, ironic is that? What a tag, though. Crazy. We just caught a tag fish. That means that it's been tagged before. So what we're going to do is take the tag, set it back, then we'll show where the fish has been, where it was tagged, actually. 38, 39 inches. 39 inches. Right there. So that's about 20 pounds, right? Yep. <laughs> All, right. All right, let's go catch some more. Yeah. Although there are no false abacore here, the stripers are definitely on. Here we go. That's a better fish. The action has been amazing, and it just got better. I've got a really nice striper. But we might lose it. It's barely hooked. Rob sees that and jumps in right away to get the fish. Watch out, Rob. He could get slammed against the rocks. But thankfully, there aren't any big waves rolling in right now. We're in this guy's extreme. And Rob has clearly done this before. Good job, man. <laughs> Woo! Good job. <laughs> a nice fish. That's a nice fish right there. Yes. Look at the size of this bass. <laughs> now you understand why we swim out to the rock? Beautiful animal. Beautiful fish. Thanks for grabbing that fish, man. Oh, that thing was barely hooked. I thought it was a goner. Oh, yeah. I was going after that no matter what. <laughs> He's gone, man. Good job, bud. 